Hello, it's Safraz here, Saf, with Business Networking Bites. This is bite number seven, and I'm calling this one Horses for Courses. If you're in business, you'll know that success usually comes by building a great team, and in that respect, most of us have heard of Belbin's team roles. Here, they use the term shaper, plant, implementer. These are roles and responsibilities that need to be fulfilled and are crucial for the success of the team and the business as a whole. I believe most of us can relate to Belbin because this is still taught at colleges and universities throughout the world. Similarly, in business network, one needs to focus on building a dream team of people. You may already know these people and it may be a case of unlocking opportunities. I'm not presenting a definitive list here, but your network needs to have the following. Firstly, EMCs. These are experts, mentors and challengers. You need to be able to access specialist technical experts when you need to including the strategists who can help you guide and plan. In addition, you're able to ask for advice and go through pros and cons with them. These people keep you grounded and are ideal to share your goals as well as help you network and grow. When you speak to an EMC, they will assist you in reaching your destination. Secondly, we have EDIs. These are energizers, the dynamic and inspirational people within your network. These lift you up and enthuse you with ideas, positivity and energy. These people are usually generous with their time and push you to achieve more. They are usually entrepreneurs themselves and are ambitious and courageous. They are big thinkers and ideas people. You will enjoy their company and feel relaxed, motivated and charged to go. Lastly, we have APCs, which are ambassadors, patrons and connectors. These are influential people, the giving people. They are your word of mouth promoters. They take an element of personal risk by not just giving you advice, but with action as well. They're openly pleased to be associated with you. They connect you with people. They're always inviting you and introducing you to others. They're interested in developing you and seeing you grow. They have your back and they thrive on your achievements. As I said, this is not a comprehensive or a definitive list, but it covers most bases and is a start for you to identify and understand the power of people and finding the right people. That was my discussion of building the dream team for networking called Horses for Courses. This was Business Networking Bites. This was bite number seven, and it's the last bite in this series, well, at least for this year. I hope you've enjoyed the videos. I certainly have, and I've also received great feedback throughout as well. So thank you. Kindly stay in touch with me on the usual social media channels. Thank you once again for your time and contribution. Catch you guys soon.